back with a tutorial on a Korean inspired burgundy makeup. So I started off with moisturizer, then work in your favorite BB cream until it blends into your skin. Next, I'm using this concealer pencil to conceal my under eye circle. After that, set it all with loose powder. Now for the brows, I'm trying to mimic straight Korean brows, then blend it with a spoolie afterwards. I'm also going over it with a light brown shade to lighten the brows. And running this on the sides of my nose for contouring. For the eyes, layer any peachy pink eyeshadow or cream eyeshadow and a darker pink to create a gradient effect. Also run this along the outer thirds of the lower lash line. Now this blush has gold specks in it which makes it quite rosy gold in shade so I'm just applying that all over the lids. Also on the egg yosal or the lower lash line. Now I'm using brown gel liner and just extending it to create puppy eyes, not cat eyes. Curl your lashes and apply mascara. And yes, you could curl your lower lashes. Next is contour. Now apply this on the hollows of your cheek, jaw lines, and the side of your forehead. Now this blush is more on the shimmery side than the pigmented, so I'm using this as a highlighter as well. Apply this on the cheekbone, cheekbones, forehead, down to the chin. And for the blush, I'm applying pink on the apples of your cheek, then a darker pink just between the contour and the highlight for a gradient effect. Now speaking of gradient effect, let's move on to the famous Korean gradient lip. Lighten the sides of your lips with BB cream, then with a lip tint, apply this only on the center of your lips. That is to make your lips look smaller. And we're done! Thanks for watching! Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Bye!